All right, you guys, so the materials you're gonna need is gonna be a simple comb, the Ritz um, hair dye. Well, it's not hair dye, I got it at Michael's in the craft section. You're gonna need some boiling water, and then you're obviously gonna need the hair. Duh. Mine's is a 613, and I got it on Amazon, and you're just gonna wanna boil your water and then pour your Ritz dye. I personally just threw the whole thing in there. I said, hey, why not? So you're just gonna pour the whole thing or half or however much you wanna put, honestly. Whatever you feel comfortable with or if you don't like it the first go round, just do it again and pour the whole thing. And then slowly you're just gonna wanna dip the hair in just so you're making sure that you're basically getting all the hair soaked into the boiling water. And I moved it off the stove the way it was not on, if you know what I mean. <laughs> So I'm just soaking it here. I'm gonna leave it for about 10 to 15 minutes, depending on however long you wanna leave it. The longer, it doesn't make a difference. But and then you're just gonna wanna pour out the water. You're gonna wanna have some cool running water. I had mine's really hot, so I had to change it. And then you're just pretty much soaking, taking out the, the leftover water, I guess you can say. So you're just um, rinsing it out. This is the cotton candy pink that I was looking for. This is the color, exactly the color I was going for. Like I said, you could do, probably use two bottles if you wanna go a little pinker. Mine's was the rose pink and I got the exact look that I wanted so I hope you guys enjoyed leave your comments down below and subscribe thank you